Okay, let's start at the beginning of this picture. There's so many bands at that time that were just so vital, you know, it seemed like it had this like uncensored energy. I couldn't believe it. I'd never heard music like that. It was completely foreign to me and super exciting. It really is all because of Nirvana. Their record came out just before us and is just selling millions and millions. And bands don't, didn't do that unless you're a Madonna. Record labels in Los Angeles were just dropping money on bands left and right. Okay, let's form a line over there with your checkbooks. There's so many sad stories of, of records that were made and, and then shelved and they never got put out. And, you know. I mean, multiple people out there, players and musicians and writers and singers and who should be giant. I do know that there are a lot of great bands from the 90s that never got heard. Creativity meets commerce, and they go smash, 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 and like, what's going to happen? Don't put out a scary record right now. Put out another happy, pretty record. That was the moment when we had this realization of, of what was going on, that we didn't have any control. We shot a video and it never made it anywhere. It never, never got shown anywhere. It happened that fast for us, the decline. Now that's the 90s right there.